hello everybody so some people asked me that how can you create a drop down from a list from another sheet in excel so today i'm going to show you how to do just that in any excel from 2007 up to 2016 so let's get started so the first thing we need to do is to open Excel and as you remember we have um, my add-in install it is called the Excel autocomplete by Ohin add-in and this this add-in uh, helps you to create drop down for a range of cells which you define from a list also defined by you so first of all I have a list of countries here in sheet number one for example I have some countries here someone uh, from Europe maybe England and uh, Asia this is where I live so this is we have a list of uh, countries here and uh, we want to have a drop down uh, suggestion in this these cells in sheet number two so how, how can we do that that's the first thing we need to do is to define this range by giving them by giving it a name so I will give them a name here and go to sheet number two select the cells I want to have the drop down list appear as I type I click on the tab add-ins here click on create combo the countries and choose and that's it now if I click on these cells it will see a combo box appear for example this one and I will start typing for example I start typing VI and you can see that Vietnam appears on the list I click I press the down arrow to select the only option here and to enter and as you can see that the cursor automatically will do the next line the next cell down below of the, the cell Vietnam so for example I enter another name Argentina there's no Argentina in the list so if we delete all of them we have the, all the countries appear in uh, the suggestion box so I click I type England B for Brazil H for Honduras like that and you can see that we can type the list very very fast so by using this add-in we can save a lot of time so that is how you can set up a succession uh, from a list That's li uh, that list can be in any sheet of your of your workbook so you can even create a, rare, uh, a list of cells like that and also click on create combo select countries and then click on that you can see that we can create we can apply this function anywhere in the workbook so that's it I hope the video has been helpful to you if you have any questions just uh, give me a comment uh, goodbye and see you soon in the next videos